Jay Edwards, Sprite Training. Today I'm at Westside Barbell in Columbus, Ohio. I'm here to train with Louis Simmons, world champion powerlifter. Learn a bit more about maximal strength. Utilize my ever-going knowledge of um, developing as a strength coach. As a young strength coach, I like to work with different um, coaches from all over the world in order to de develop my understanding of the field which I'm in. So today I'm looking at maximal strength. Have a sit down with Louis and uh, go through some training techniques that will help enlighten me for the future. Run what I have to do. Right. I'm, I'm, you're going to stand up. And you're, I want you to walk for two minutes. Right. But you're going to just march it. Right. Okay. So stand up. And stand up. Hit. Right. Walk for a little bit. Got it. And again, we like to push out because it builds a lot of lateral muscles that people don't have. Get your feet a little wider. Yeah, go wide. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Get way out wide like an ice cream. Yeah, that wasn't easy. And I felt activation in the posterior that I've never felt before doing squats, deadlifts. Yeah, this, and you see how fast it is? Yes. And, and, and the thing is, see, this belt is going to correct pelvic, getting pelvic tilt, it will try to shut your spine. So tomorrow you're going to go, no, I didn't do nothing, but you're way stronger. Now, jump up, jump up. Now, no, uh, and what we do is we use the fat and citrix. Fat and hard any uh, resistance on your centric phase. So slow, slow, slow and centric. Get the cage, get the good cage. There you go. Now, look at yourself. Your shift's got straight on top. You have to pull yourself out. You feel that? Here, that's your that's your yeah. Well, box squats. See, when you sit on that box, your muscles are lengthening slowly and then contracting. Lengthening and contracting. And so you break up the eccentric and eccentric chain, and that's what you do when you run. Yes. Okay. Oh, Just do it. Tell me when you go. Is there a slow concentric tape where it's off and it gets harder? Right. You want to do another set with that 20 less, just to see, see how it works. Right. So you, you, you move the weight in for more repetition? I take the weight down and the repetition will come down. Here, I'll show you. <laughs> Sorry. Well, I'll go down. 15 pounds. Right. But you just slowly reduce weight. Right. And your hamstrings just straight to yourself. Right. Hips. You got Hips forward. There you go. I'll try it. Yep. Head to knee the straight line now. Yep, yep, oh, oh. Okay, is that good? Yeah, yeah, yeah. see? That's 15, 15 pounds. Uh, inverse curl. Inverse curl. Yep, all right. Inverse curl, belt's on. And then you supply the zinc. Yeah. Um, um, have you ever done reverse curls? What you see down there? Um, I've never done the reverse like this. <laughs> I saw a look at his face. Okay. And he doesn't know his book. Bring again. Oh, okay. I got out here Friday night again. And then Saturday, all that Saturday. But watch, he's going to do a real slick. I'm going to show you. I'll talk. It's, okay. He's going to squeeze his feet, his toes, right there. He gets a tremendous activation in here. But this is, he's going to try to fight it. It's, try to hold it, but he can't. You know, raise it, fight it, drop it. Eccentric, concentric, static has got it all three. Just blows. It's hard, it's as hard as you can squeeze. Isometrically, okay? Right. Huh. Okay. I blow people up. I don't know nothing about track and I'm gonna blow everybody up. Right. I mean I mean if I if I had a you know, I, I like numbers, okay? We live weights, we got numbers. If my numbers are bigger than you, I'm better than you. If me and you race and your numbers faster than mine, you're better than me. I, I like numbers. I don't want to know beauty contest crap. So I mean I I, I we beg for a sprinter. Uh, a real sprinter. If a if a guy had a, a good sprint coach and he came here Mm -hmm. I guarantee you make them go faster. Right. From what I do. And I've always said, you know, if I send a guy to you or I send that girl down, you probably, hell, Lord knows what you do with them. You know, because you're so good at technique and environmental mechanics. But this is the importance. This is, this is the fundamental. This is the base. Right. This, yeah. this, this try is this so out. Just go right. real slow. Okay. Remember, you got to try to fight it down. You're not going to be able to hold it. So let's try to fight it down and try to do 20 reps. And what you do is you've never done this. What you do when you go, you take a breath on the way down, right. flex your belly on the way up. Okay. Just like lift the weights. Put my feet in there. Yeah. All right. Yeah. Put your feet in there. All right. 
Hey, hey Joe, Joe, yeah. for yeah. a track team or something, don't you think this would be this would be the machine? It would be the number one piece. It'd be the, 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 the number one piece. Okay. Oh yeah. This this okay. So I'm, I'm up, up, yeah. jump up pretty good. Place that right on the top. All right, feet, hang on to the feet together, feet together. Squeeze your toes as hard as you can together. Your toes are in. Okay, just get it moving. Use a little bit of momentum. Is there any momentum? Today? Yeah, a little bit. You got to get it going. Kick it, kick it. Hey, keep his legs straight. Legs straight. Squeeze your ass. Pick your head up. Drop your head. Pick your head up. Hey, pick your head up. Drop it. Pick. You do not. All right, hold on. Hold on. Up. Up. Oh, you just had it. Up. Up. Down. Up. Down. Now, now try to control it. Control. Slow it up. Slow it up. He doing a bad move. Sorry. He looked like he's going to go. Feet up, head up. Feet up, head up. Feet up, head up. So feet up, head up. Yeah. Hey. <laughs> this is a pretty tough one. Yeah. Is it too tough? Listen, come here. OG. Hey, come here. Do this. Try on this one. Do that. It's the same thing. It's just, yeah, it's same thing. just go ahead and do like 20 reps. This would be more like this is one for you. <laughs> yeah, I like it. But you, you let it come way on here. There you go. There you go. There you go. Control that little bit. Slow on the way down just a little. There you go. Hit it. Release. Hit it. Release. Keep the legs straight. Keep the legs straight. 20 or 25 reps. You get down here. Head up and feet go up. Head up. There you go. <laughs> that was like 50. All right. Take this bar. If you could do a straight one pull down with a flat bar, yes, you're bringing yep. that bar in. Uh -huh. When I'm here, I actually do my lats and bring that bar into my body. That way it's as close to my body as possibly can be. Bring it nice and close. I take it from here. Now watch this bar. Watch what happens when I actually sit back and reach into it. I haven't even begun to lift yet. And the bar's off the ground. Alright, that's because when I'm here, I actually I'm pulling back. I'm sitting back onto an imaginary box. The pull begins before you even start doing anything. So I'm here, I leverage back, the bar's off the ground. From here on, you don't push. You spread the ground, you want to rip the carpet, push out, not into the ground, push out and pull back at the same time. You're right there. If I'm just pushing into the ground, this mess is gonna happen. Your chest is gonna move, back gets curved, bar's gonna be forward, you're gonna miss the lift. You don't get into her walking around, you don't walk around. What would you say in this one? $3,500. Yeah. We can exchange bands. You got to use the company in business. Otherwise, most people don't live away from that. I've learned so much. They say speaking to having a 10 minute conversation with a wise man is more than you can learn in 10 minutes. So, look, there you go. There you go. And you're a government you. <laughs> I'm still wondering who the wise man is. <laughs>